ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Youth Edition. It's Barrio Barros, it's Selford City FC on a quest for Champions League glory. Sit back, relax, get in your comfy chair, grab your favourite beverage, turn on that big screen TV, because here we go with the Youth Edition. Hello and welcome back to the Youth Edition Career Mode. FIFA 20, Salford City. We sit in 12th after our first two games in the Premier League. We beat Oldham Athletic. That's probably the main thing. But then we did lose to Aston Villa, unfortunately. Uh, the transfer window won't shut in today's episode, I believe. Or it might. I think there's three games. So we'll see how we're, uh, we're going for talent and uh, whether we can get the job done. Uh, we have got West Ham United up first who uh, haven't started the season off that well, just the two draws for them. Uh, and then we've got the Carabao Cup, I think, against the MK Don, so a chance to see the uh, the reserves line up in action. And, um, yeah, we'll see if we can get any transfers done. I really want to sell Barker, um, just to, you know, make sure there's a decent injection of cash into our uh, our kitty. I think we're sitting at about 65 million. So uh, if we want, say, the Ronaldo regen, we're probably going to be looking at about 80 million. Um, that's about the going price for him. Uh, so we still need to generate a shitload of funds if we really want to pull a few players here in this transfer window. But let's jump into it. Let's get a player upgrade done. Right, so today's player upgrade will be for Ryan Froome, the uh, English left midfielder. He's got a bit of, uh, you know, must have been watching Thor Gunnarsson because he's got his old haircut here by the looks of things. But, you know, Froome, if you want to make any changes to his number or kit, obviously potential to be special. Uh, maybe he'll get some game time this season. Maybe he'll get a loan spell before the transfer window opens. I don't know what's going to happen here with Froome, but, um, yeah, he's an Englishman, so he's on the list. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. First game of today's episode. We are at the London Stadium taking on West Ham. I'm going to bring the DK formation out. Uh, I'm just, you know, it's tricky because uh, we get firing with a diamond cutter and then we get pulled apart with the diamond cutter and uh, we create no opportunities and sometimes we create a lot of opportunities. I guess it just comes down to the formations that we're playing against. But this one is proven... Uh, from seasons gone by. Uh, so I'm going to go back to it today. Mercado on the left-hand side. Jose Michaels comes in for Ian Griffiths. So there's the two CDMs playing. And uh, hopefully we can find some counter-attack football. Unleash goodness and get a win here on the road. Let's do it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're here at the London Stadium. As the commentary just said. And we are taking on West Ham United. Now, uh, I'm pretty sure that they've got the Aguero region, possibly. So, um, yeah, this could be a tough little encounter. But they haven't started the season off well. They'll be looking for their first win. And we're looking to take them down. Well, it's quick passing play, but Diogo Neves is there just to weather the storm here early. But they play it inside again. Got Haller. He's been double teamed. Laid out, and a great save from Sinotti. How the fuck did they get that ball inside? Wowzers. Lanzini's got on the end of it, but Zanotti looks like he is prepared for a big season. Oh, that one's off the side, Bart. Lascelles get that shit out. It's Mercado and the pressure being applied here early. It's a good block from Power Power, but Neves is there for the clearance. Mercado slips it off and we look for Dion to set some play up. Gets it out the back door. Mercado plays it forward now. Here is Thor Gunnarsson, his first touch of the day. He's got pace. He gets around his man. He'll look back inside. Oh, jeez, how did they pick that out? Good from La Sarsa. Read it like a book, but Cassis Casado. Oh, he might have got a touch. Plays it out wide. Mercado back down the line. Cassis Casado's kept running. Feed it out. Here's Mercado. Whips it in. Oh, it was ill-directed. He finds some space. Michaels. Dion. Jose Michaels finds Cesario. Oh, a little bit of trickery. Cesario pushes his way inside and tries the strike. He was under a lot of pressure. Lays it off. Cassis Casado back to Jose Michaels. Cassis Casado. Look at the pressure coming from West Ham. Here's Michaels inside Gunnison. Lays it off. Cassis Casado. Oh, taken out. Ref. No. Cassis Casado is down. And Zanotti, you're very far forward, mate. Oh, look out. Cassis Casado, Mercado, De Jong flicks through. Has Gunnarsson. Oh, done. He's been transferred. He's not playing for Oldham now. He's playing for West Ham. Fuck me, he's had two games against bloody Salford City in like a week. 
Oh, Jose Michaels, what an interception. The American dusts himself off and works his way forward, crosses it inside, but Dunk, oh, he knows all about Thor Gunnison. Oh, so Noddy gets a finger on it. Denying West Ham a late goal. They do have a corner. It's deep. Oh, Dunn got up. And it's another corner. Come on, boys. Don't let a goal in here before fucking half time. It's a naughty good punch. Well, there's the whistle. Nil all at half time. Oh, Justice Pow Pow. That's a brilliant take. Gunnison's going to try and get in here. No. De Jong does well. Flicks it off. Here's Mercado. He drives his way inside. Oh, referee! Come on, man! De Jong plays it forward. Cassis Casado makes the break. He's into the box. He's going to have to feed it off here. Oh, no. You needed to get to De Jong running through, sir. Right, Mercado with a bit of a knock and De Jong running out of juice. So Griffiths checks into the cam roll. And Davies in on the left-hand side. It's a simple finish. Anything along the ground just seems to be going in. And West Ham fight their way to the lead. 73 minutes gone here at the London Stadium. We've done well up until now. You can just see a big gap opening up there. And as soon as it's on the ground, none of our goalkeepers seem to be able to get down and make a save. I was going for this bloody foot. Shove it out there, but you're not getting close to that one, Sonotti. 1-0. All right, Cesario taken off for Leroy Jenkins. Desperate for a goal now. Late forward, Gunnison sets off Leroy Jenkins. Leroy Jenkins on the charge. He needs to finish Leroy. Oh, fuck me. Good goalkeeping. Griffiths interception. Cassis Casado flicks on. Has Leroy Jenkins. He's in the game again, Leroy. Oh, jeez, just the touch. Cassis Casado. Oh, they're just getting caught on the ball. Fucking wake up, you cunts. Well, there we go. Defeat to West Ham United. We're not showing up. Well, Sonotti kept us in the game. Only two shots. We're just not creating enough. Sassel with a 7.2. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is the Carabao Cup. We have got the MK Dons, and we've got this team to put out on the pitch today. Leroy Jenkins at left wing. Angsley is the striker. He's up to a 74. Fook and G to a 71 on the right-hand side. Elrico and Allen will control the midfield. Dax Shepard is the anchor. Lambert and Snow are the wingbacks. And John Stone, Stevenson, the captain, and Maguire between the sticks. Let's see if we can push through in this cup competition. All right, ladies and gentlemen, well, a bit up and down form there in the Premier League, but this is Cup time, Carabao Cup, and a chance for some of these youngsters to really push and make a name for themselves to see if they'll be around here for years to come. These are the kind of important matches for some of these youngsters to uh, really show that, you know, they've got something about them and that they're due to hold contracts for, you know, when we get to European football. So uh, a big game, some debuts with uh, Snow, I think, making his debut. Logan Snow, the Canadian right back, and uh, Maguire there back from his loan spell. So let's get into it. Leroy Jenkins, it's a five man midfield here, which means they've only got three at the back. And if we can get a ball forward here for Ainsley, Ainsley drives forward. Ainsley gets in, lad. Well, there we go. Ainsley gets the finish. And makes it 1 0 the Fiddler strikes. He's back from his loan spell. He's ready for a fresh season here at Salford City straight through the gate lovely ball from Leroy Jenkins and Ainsley just pops it home, it's 1-0 to the Amis on to corner here for the MK Dons what are they going to do with it drive it long, Lambert got up, to come back in, we need to be careful, don't give away any penalties and Maguire gets in there and makes the save good from Lambert Jenkins, El Rico, Allen, Shepard, oh, couldn't lay it through, Allen does get one through, no, almost Leroy, El Rico, Shepard, Ainsley, trying some trickery, Angus Ainsley, oh, he's worked the goalkeeper with that, wow, Get inside, Ainsley, turns his man, lays it off, 
Jakey Allen. Oh, get in there, Shepard. Oh. Off this time. There is half time. Well, Salford City have the lead and they've looked the aggressor, but they're going to need a few more goals, you'd feel. Allen does well, finds Dak Shepard. Fucking G, where is your run, son? There it is. Keep running. Oh. Dax, interception. Fucking G. Up the back door. Leroy Jenkins, use that burst of pace, son. Oh. Dax Shepard. Jakey Allen in the box. Jakey Allen! Allen! Let's go! 2 0 Salford City. Allen! 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 Gets in. Oh, 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 chicken dance. Jakey Allen with his first of the season. It's 2 0 here against the MK Dons in the Carabao Cup. Set up by Dak Shepard. Jakey Allen just takes it upon himself to smash and hog. And it just shows like the youngsters are there. They're just not quite at that top level, but they're on their way. So I'm reluctant to spend a lot of money unless it's some key marquee players that are going to be big for our future. Oh, lovely work from Dax Shepard. Slips it off. Leroy Jenkins, he'll take his man on. Oh, he's got his shirt pulled, but he doesn't care. Leroy Jenkins driving his way down the wing. What can he do here? Looks back inside. Has El Rico. And why the fuck did you do that? Oh, lovely read, John Stone. Leroy. Dance through the middle. Here's Allen. Gets it off. Ainsley. Jakey Allen in the box. Jakey oh, Allen. Allen! He gets his second. Allen! And it's 3 0. Allen! Let's go, Allen! gentlemen. Allen! Lovely 1 2, Jakey Allen. And that is an exquisite finish. 3 0. Jakey loving the Carabao Cup. Oh, keeper. Right, we're going to make some changes here. Elrico out for Carlos. He's going to get some minutes. Jose Michaels checks into the CDM role. Dak Shepard is centre back and Stephenson to left back. And Froome is in on the left hand side. Jenkins needs a rest. He's been a workhorse today. Good from Stephenson. Carlos lays off. It was Michaels. Plays it forward. Janky Allen has a crack. Oh, <laughs> looking for a hat trick. Carlos, Dak Shepard pushing forward, Michaels gets it inside, here is Jakey Allen, oh good save, works his way through, still goes, Shepard lays it off, oh I was looking for Jake, picked out again, that should be the whistle, it's a 3-0 victory for Salford City and we're through to the next round, well done lads, 9 shots to 2, Jakey Allen with a 9.5. Right, final game of the episode at home at the GTG Arena. We're hosting Brighton and Hove Albion. We go with the first 11, the diamond cutter formation. We need a win, boys. Let's go. All right, here we are at the GTG Arena. Looking for our first win at home after going down to Aston Villa. Uh, can we get some redemption here against Brighton and Hove Albion? Out, out. Griffiths out wide looking for Cesario. Oh, good. Whoa, ref, ref, ref! Absolute carnage here. What the fuck? What on earth just happened? Ravalada. Griffiths. Cesario looks inside. Gunnison. 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 Oh, he's offside. Wake. Fuck you. Put your flag away. Oh. Lasasa, Cassis, Casado finds Davies. Got a sent to Griffiths. He has to hold up the play. Back off. Dion. Got a sent. Got a sent. Got a sent. Wow. Come on, boys. Now, pow, pow. Oh, lovely little faint touch. Cassis, Casado. Griffiths plays it forward. Got a sent. Gets stuck in his feet. Finds De Jong. De Jong will look back inside. Has Griffiths. Ah, oh, there's just too many bodies. Has to play it back. This is Casado now. De Jong. Tries to work his way inside. Still comes De Jong. Plays it off. Griffiths gets the touch. Oh, the defense is on point. Well, there's one forward. Gunnison has somehow got on the end of it. Thor Gunnison. Oh, good save. 
Shit, a biscuit. Corner. Chicken nuggets. Oh, trying to turn on it. Just as pound, pound. I'm dispossessed. Griffiths does well. Dion hits up Davies. Davies pushes inside. Oh, referee! Fucking call something! Oh my days! Do we have to suck your dick or something? Fuck me! How many penalties are we owed in the last episode? Fuck me! Half time! We've been fingered by the ref! Oh, Nevis has just fucking murdered someone! Oh, well, the ref hasn't seen anything today by the looks of things. That's Griffiths. Cuts back inside, lays it forward. Gunnison! Oh, fucking keeper! He is coming off his lines. Well, Davies can't run this injury off. He's going to be checked out for Leroy Jenkins. Let's inject that pace in on the wing. Leroy. Cassis Casado. Here is Griffiths. Finds an opening. No, he doesn't. Good tackle. Brighton and Hove Albion are defending well. Awobi takes it to the back of the melon. And Leroy just runs straight past it. Everything's happening here today. Fires off. Griffiths. Down the line, gonna sit. Oh, fucking hell, ref! Mate! Do you know where your fucking whistle is? Pull it out of your ass! He's got the run. Gonna sit. In the box. Griffiths spits out the back door, has Cesario, lays it off for Gunnison. He turns and shoots. He's taken out. Oh my days, referee! You found your fucking whistle, mate! Well done, son! Jesus Christ! He's fucking called something. Is it a pen or is it a free kick? I think it's a penalty. Let's go. Smash it home, Thor. Bang! Let's go, Salford City. 1 0. And the big man gets his second of the season from the penalty spot. He just makes that. Loves that bottom left corner. Let's go, 1 0. Right, we'll make the changes. Jose Michael's in for Dion. And Jackie Allen checks in for Griffiths. With Cassis Casado into the midfield. It's going to be defensive and hold this 1 0 lead. But maybe Jakey Allen can snag something here. Playing in here for Lassar. So it took a bobble. Cassis Casado. There's another free kick, ref. Fuck me, mate. This dude needs a fucking bullet. And there is the whistle. Well, three points secured for Salford City, but we need to be a lot more prolific if we want to be a top team in this league. Eight shots to three. Gunnison with an 8.7. Fuck me, we should have had about three penalties in that one. 16 tackles from Brighton. They were out for blood. So Declan Davies has broken his toe. That's a big injury here in FIFA 20. So he is out for two months. We'll miss his defensive pressure, but we've got options to cover him on the wings. Right, and so we, as it is transfer deadline day, I'm going to end the episode here. I'm going to have a real hard look at our transfer options. But about 80 million, no nibbles in for Barker as of yet, or uh, any of the Englishmen to be fair. But um, yeah, we'll see what happens. It's transfer deadline day. Crazy shit does happen. Chelsea on top now with 10 points, and they're undefeated, along with Spurs, Watford, Aston Villa still undefeated as well. Uh, Man City down in seventh. Uh, we currently sit in 11th with a two and two record, six points. And shit, where did that come from? Oldham Athletic sitting 15th. Um, one, one, and two. So, um, yeah. Interesting start to the season. We just need to create a bit more opportunity. Uh, I think defensively we've been quite good. Um, Zanotti's been good. If we can just find a way to, to fire in a few more goals, uh, I think we will be in some red hot form. But that's where we'll leave it today. We'll be back with transfer deadline day in the next episode. I'm Spiring DK. It's five o'clock somewhere. And you have a good one. The Sparring DK channel now has Patreon, and if you feel like just going that little extra step to help, uh, you know, the channel grow, you can go across to the website, pledge your allegiance to myself, and uh, for one dollar a month, you're basically putting it in a jar and allowing for us to go and buy some more beers and record some more beer drinking episodes. Thank you very much to the current lads that have gone ahead and supported the channel. Absolutely tremendous to see 
anybody willing just to give that one dollar a month at this stage i cannot thank you from the bottom of my heart you, you really will make a difference in the future so jump across there if you're that way inclined to the patreon channel sign up today and we'll see if we can get some extra beer drinking episodes for you at home now if you are looking for some more content we've got a couple of videos one here one here and if you want to subscribe there's a button right there so go ahead subscribe and you'll be notified when the videos